in the name of journalism. I'm going to be going out with my heat gun. I'll be testing the temperatures of pavements, cars, playgrounds, buses, public transport, and we'll see just how hot it's going to get. It's about midday here in Shirley, and at the moment, the temperatures, according to my iPhone, it's about 32 degrees, which of course, on any normal summer's day, is still excruciatingly hot. But let's start by just getting a temperature of the pavement at midday. So I'm hoping that you can see that. Um, I'll put my gun on, it's a laser gun. So this is saying 41 degrees, 42 degrees. We can try a little bit of grass too. Let's see if the, the grass is any cooler than the pavement. That's coming at 43 degrees Celsius-ish. Whereas the shadows are any, any cooler. Yeah, the shadows are much cooler. That's 30-ish, 30, 30 29, 30 degrees Celsius. But when you're right in the direct sunlight, that's when you get the really high temperatures in the, in the 40 degrees Celsius mark. Now, thankfully, my car has got air con but I've been out on a job in Shirley. I've left my car parked up on the road and it is sat in the direct sunlight. Um, let's see what my car is like um, before we head on our journey. So this is the exterior of my car. It's reading at about 55 uh, degrees Celsius on the black metal panel. That is a hot car. Let's see what it's like inside. I feel as though I need a health and safety form to be in here. It's absolutely roasting hot. Um, I'll try and turn you around and show you some of the temperatures that I'm getting on the inside of my car. Try the steering wheel, what do you think it'll be? 46 degrees um, in the inside of my car. Let's try one of the seats. 67, 68 on the, on, the, on the leather chunk of my seat. Gosh, I need to get the windows open. <laughs> So that's what the TomTom -tom says. It reckons it's 39 degrees Celsius inside the car. A slightly different reading from my gun. Now I'm not an expert in these things, but I think either way, um, it is a really, really, really hot day uh, across the Midlands. Now, by some miracle, I've managed to survive and my car has managed to survive and we have now made it to Touchwood in Solihull where the car park is not quite underground, but it is sheltered and a lot cooler. Let's see what it's like when we get into the main shopping centre. Now, Touchwood is much, much, much cooler. They've clearly got the aircon whacked all the way up. If you're looking for somewhere to come that's cool, Touchwood is probably the place to be. I'm going to get on the first bus that I see, hopefully one that will take me to Solihull train station. Let's see how hot the bus is and let's see how hot it is on the train. Here we go. Bus is 33 degrees on uh, the metal back of the bus. I try the seat next to me. That's 31, 33 degrees again on the seat. Not too bad. Windows. If you're leaning your head up against the window, how hot's that going to be? That's about 31. Again, about 33 degrees. So that's that's about the the temperature on a bus. About 30 to 33 degrees Celsius. It's definitely not cold we get on the train let's try the pavement again let's see how we get on with that now 49 degrees celsius so still very very hot it's about uh, probably about 2 p.m now i think i'll jump on the second one uh, to birmingham moor street and let's see how we get on in terms of the temperature on the train we've just made it on and we're about to start our journey to birmingham um, let's see how we're looking on the train and it is about 28.5, so slightly cooler than it was on the bus. Here I am at Tudor Grange Park and Tudor Grange Playground in the centre of Solihull. I've just tested these metal benches, which are already 30 degrees Celsius. They've been sat in the sun all day. Let's go and test some of the playground equipment uh, and see how hot that is. You can see that it's understandably very, very quiet here. Uh, Tudor Grange Park. The metal slide is about 25 degrees Celsius, so it's not as hot as you might imagine. It's not anywhere near as hot as my car was 
earlier on, but it is certainly uh, not cool. And I'm not sure uh, many parents would want their children going up and down this slide. It's, it's slightly fluctuating as I move around and I think I've confused the reader a little bit, but it's certainly not uh, a cool slide to say the least. So there you have it, that marks the end of our journey across a boiling hot Solihull in Birmingham. It was a journey that we started in Shirley, we went over to Solihull, over to Birmingham and now back uh, ending the journey at Tudor Grange Playground where we've measured various surfaces have really given us a, an indicator of how hot it is uh, in these unprecedented temperatures the country is seeing and the region is seeing. I'm looking forward to getting back to my hopefully cool car uh, in the underground Touchwood car park 